Welcome back, everybody, for another mod review. Uh, I just got through doing an episode this morning on a Black Mountain <clears throat> featuring G&G's log cabin house here. So you can go back a couple episodes if you want to see it. And a person pointed out how nice this razor was, and it is a wonderful razor. What wound up being the author of, or the person who brought it forward, FS19, the razor. And it's by Big Country Modding. They do have a YouTube page. They also have a website so you can get a lot of their mods and stuff. It's Big Country Modding Wix site. Uh, for the actual link, you can go to Big Country Modding's Facebook page. They have the link to the website, the link to their YouTube. And Austin is the one who turned me on to this and let me know this was his. Uh, mod this razor is awesome it's in like a dozen of my videos but we're looking at the horse paddock in this episode I just want to let y'all know who who brought that razor in that I just love I get the same color and it's in so many of my videos but I was talking that oh, I gotta sell my placement first but I was talking in it about how um, this this map just demands that you do logging or possibly even some horse riding in it so I'm going to show that now because the person who did the small horse paddock has brought it back and I had mentioned a few things that I thought need to be done or changed but it really didn't take away from it at all uh, I think it's something that was really needed it's early game stuff and for people who need to save money early on I thought it was a great idea of course it just dropped it down over there when I aimed for it over here but that's fine I don't think it's gonna affect it none we'll see if it does I'll just restart the whole video but I was gonna put the house here and it jumped over here but that's probably because uh, just using a mix of controller along with but I was talking about over here this horse ranch and how it was a great place to start especially if you're in the horses and if you don't want to do a lot of horse breeding or if you just want to start off small and have a beautiful country to train your horses this would be the place to do it so we're gonna head over that way I got the small container the IBC you search for it on mod hub um, just got a little small water source but if you go over the water area if you got your horse ball you'll see it draining really fast on a bottom right there is no animation for the water but for early game this is is a mod that's really nice to have because it saves a ton of money so we're gonna go here and test the food section hopefully without any incident but I mean that's part of it earlier I was filling up the water container at the river and it all ended up in the river <laughs> so I'm just trying to get it ready and my wife said you should show that part to <laughs> I'm like no 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 I don't want to do that but I mean if I was to do a video on failures all I gotta do is just show a little horse play at 8x and y'all get to see a bunch of them so come up with the food food has no trouble as always and I didn't have any trouble with uh, purchasing or really anything with this mod as far as the triggers working I'm getting the truck hopefully I haven't messed that trigger up because it was working okay it's still working it's just now it's a part of the house which is kind of funny so I think I'll leave that in a video if nothing else for the humor of it but before this right here was really small you could not work a horse through it you and I mentioned also maybe instead of having to open and put a gate on it and they responded evidently because now there is a beautiful working gate uh, it's just a regular on my controller it's a B command 
there's also left click mouse so yeah that works and I have tried to ride a horse through it but I'll show you as long as you stick to the center uh, there's really no issues at all as you can see if you get clo too close to the fence it will rise up and it will get blocked if you go too close to the shed but you can see just stick to the center it looks perfectly natural you can see there's no purchase uh, problems um, doing anything with this so now as I was saying the perfect logging map to me in my opinion which is Black Mountain and it don't have to be everybody's opinion it's just mine it's just something that I like Run into a gate. There we go. So anyway, if you can actually steer a horse, you now have some beautiful country to train your horse. And you get all kinds of views and stuff with it. You're not gonna have no trouble going up and down mountains and stuff. These animals isn't gonna bother your horse. <laughs> but there's there's several places of bears and stuff like that. And what better place to train a horse? I mean, seriously. So the mod is back, the small horse paddock. They did a, a really nice job on fixing the errors. And so to me, it's pretty much one of the best horse paddocks there is in the game because it offers um, early start. Whereas you're not having to have a great big farm or any of that kind of stuff to have horses in the game. Some people wants to test and try out horses. I did for a while. So I actually used their horse paddock to try out to see if I even want to mess with horses. Uh, my daughter loves horses in the game. So... Now she has a functional paddock that's small. She don't have to dedicate a lot of her game resources to do. And if you noticed in that area over too, there's a riding area so you can jump and train horses and stuff like that. But I mean, this is amazing to be able to do that. But clearly, as you see, it is all working now. It's all functional. I'll show you just to take more Black Mountain before I sign out you do got some farmlands I just uh, I don't like doing too much logging you can see these hills and stuff even with the scorpion king or doing it manually you're gonna have a ton of fun trying to get logs off this mountain and but I mean it's gonna be more like real life though so I love it I mean it's just it is as it should be to me And you can ride all over this mountain just to keep enjoying the, the views and the scenery and all that. We're coming back on the area. But like I said, if, if you're into horsery, horses and um, you want a good early start or maybe even a chance to grow, this section over here <coughs> to me is perfect. And now you can start off small, work your way up. I'll show you just a tick of it as we come up. It'd be nice if um, I know G and G modding. They did like a custom cow barn. He might could even help with even making these stables over here more of a reality. Because uh, right now they're kind of just well pictures more than anything. But of course your riding area is going to work fine, but I wouldn't be using that that much. I'd be using this right here to train. But as you can see, it all works right. The log cabin, if it didn't jump on top of my riding pack, I'm glad I didn't save my game. But if it had jumped on top of it, it would look wonderful in this section. So, I think y'all gonna like this new horse paddock. I'll give you one more look at it before I go. If I don't run over everything. I can't steer for nothing. All right, so yep, it's back, and uh, the author clearly listened. 
and they're open to fixing stuff if it isn't right. So if you see something that isn't right, then be sure to talk about it in the description and stuff. But they clearly have built to me uh, the perfect early game horse paddock. So take care, everyone. Have fun.